Welcome to the Harvard Crimson's video sports coverage, Harvard's best source for online sports news. We take you to the Bright Hockey Center, where Harvard prepares to face historic rival in sixth-ranked Cornell. Junior Doug Rogers prepares to battle Big Red goaltender Ben Scrivens, a frontrunner for the Hobie Baker Award given to the best player in college hockey. Between the pipes for Harvard is sophomore Ryan Carroll, making just his third start. We pick up in the second period, and this faceoff won by the Crimson. Midway through the second frame, a penalty sent a Cornell player to the box, giving Harvard a man advantage. The physical nature of the game led to 14 penalties on the night. The Crimson took advantage here, with Rogers finding freshman Alex Killer, who rifled a shot past Scrivens. Roasted. Killoran's goal was one of four Crimson power play scores. Carroll, who earned first star honors in the game, made 42 saves and helped Harvard go perfect on the penalty kill. Here, Carroll is seen making a few flailing stops. Someone ate his Wheaties. But the number of Cornell chances caught up with the Crimson, and Colin Greening eventually tied the game up with this one-timer. After sophomore Matt McCollum regained the lead for Harvard, freshman Daniel Moriarty added an insurance goal with his devastating top-shelf slap shot. Down late in the game, Cornell pulled its goaltender. But after a missed clearance, leading goal scorer and senior Nick Hosgren snuck in an empty netter to seal the 4-2 victory for the Crimson. Harvard had a lot to celebrate. It was the first time since November that the team recorded back-to-back -back wins. Harvard coach Ted Donato shared his thoughts. We're excited about the win. It was a good, uh, hard-fought battle. Ryan Carroll was sensational, and uh, I thought our power play was excellent. Ryan's worked awfully hard in, uh, in practice and uh, deserved an opportunity. I thought today uh, he made a couple of spectacular saves on their, on their power play. Uh, in general, your, your goaltender is always your best penalty killer, and I think uh, he certainly was tonight. 